This local sports report is presented by the Guelph Minor Football Association, proudly developing players in Guelph for community high school and youth sports football for over 25 years. Learn more about their tackle and flag programs by visiting guelphminorfootball.net. Friday night lights from Alumni Stadium. Here come the Bishop McDonnell Celtics. They were looking for a second straight win to start the season. The Celtics facing John F. Ross, who were going for their first win of the year. And it's a solid start for the BM defense. Antonio Latanzio breaking through, and he's got a sack. He takes down Royals QB Tim Nixon. A few minutes later, here comes the Celtics offense. Cole Phillips with a deep ball. Phillip Oates with the catch for a touchdown. The Celtics with the first TD of the night. It's a 20-yard passing play. BM is up 7-1. The Royals now with possession. This pass is tipped and there is Justin Valdez with the interception. He goes the other way and it's a terrific run back from Valdez. 7-1 Bishop Mack after the first. Second quarter now and it's a sack for the Royals. Isaiah Hare with a big play on defense. He tackles Cole Phillips but a little later the Celtics add to their lead on this play. It's a snap to Marco Pacheco Pachoni, he runs left, breaks a tackle, and he motors in for a touchdown. Pachoni giving his team a 14-3 advantage. Then it's the Royals punting it away, but it's partially blocked. It goes to Pachoni, and do you believe this? Oh my, Marco Pachoni! He charges down the field, and he's got another touchdown. Magnificent from Marco. He gives the Celtics an 18-point lead. It's 21-3. Back to the highlights in a minute. First a reminder, this video is presented by Guelph Minor Football, a proud supporter of District 10 football. Still in the second, the Royals trying to get something going. Callum Williams running right, and look out! Eric Verdun forcing a fumble. Marco Pachoni picks it up on the one-yard line, and here goes Pachoni. Ryan Wolf, he's number five. He's got some huge blocks. Pachoni with space, and how about this? Welcome to the Marco Pachoni Show. He takes it one 109 yards for his third touchdown of the game. It's a scoop and a score. What a night for Pachoni. It's 27-3 at the break. Third quarter now, the Celtics in the red zone, and this pass is picked off by Tian Delahanty. He ends the BM possession with a big interception. Later in the third, it's a huge play from the Celtics' defense. Sam Shoniker intercepting the pass, and he's off to the races. See you later, Sam Shoniker. He's got a Pick six. Bishop Mack is up by 30 after three quarters to the fourth, and the Royals strike on this play. Tim Nixon hitting Troy McDonald, and he scores. That's a six yard pass for the Royals' only TD of the night. When it was over, the Celtics pick up the victory. They stay perfect this season with a 33 9 win over the Royals in District 10 football. For more highlights, visit our website, 519sportsonline.ca. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter.